The Magnolia Wood satellite named Lignosat promises to pave the way for a new generation of space vehicles that do not become a threat after death. According to announcements from NASA and JAXA, U.S. and Japanese space agencies, the Lignosat wooden satellite may leave Earth in the summer of 2024. This Magnolia Wood satellite is about the size of a coffee cup and will not become dangerous pieces of space waste after its useful life expires because of its biodegradability. It will not self-destruct in the vacuum of Earth's orbit, but after use, space agencies can direct the satellite to fall back into Earth's atmosphere, where would materials easily burn. Turns into a safe, fine ash. According to Live Science, tests to find the most optimal wood material for satellites were carried out on the International Space Station ISS, earlier this year. Three wood samples of magnolia, cherry, and birch were tested and did not deform when exposed to the harsh space environment of dramatic temperature changes and exposure to intense cosmic rays. Ultimately, magnolia wood was chosen because it is less likely to crack or break during production. NASA and JAXA's Magnolia satellite is part of an effort by space agencies around the world to address an area of Earth's orbit that is becoming increasingly dangerous because of space debris. It is estimated that there are more than 9,300 tons of space objects, from inactive satellites, used rocket fragments, orbiting Earth. These objects increase the overall brightness of the night sky by more than 10%, leading to light pollution, making astronomical observations difficult. In addition, this debris is a great danger to space stations and spacecraft, including satellites operating in Earth orbit or trying to leave the Earth. Mr. Takao Doi, an astronaut and aerospace engineer at Kyoto University, said that when satellites re-enter Earth's atmosphere, they burn up and create small aluminum particles floating in the mesosphere. Saved for many years. Over time, this process will have a negative impact on the environment on Earth. The team from Kyoto University tested many different types of wood on the ISS to find one capable of withstanding the harsh conditions of space and long orbital flights, including flower wood. Japanese Cherry The results showed that the wood sample showed no signs of decomposition or damage after one year of being put into space. Their ability to endure these adverse conditions surprised us, said Mr. Koji Murata, the project leader. Among them, wood from the magnolia tree is the sturdiest. Unlike conventional satellites, Lignosat wooden satellites will safely self-destruct on the way back to Earth's atmosphere. Mr. Murata said Lignosat will be launched into space by a U.S. rocket and operate for at least six months.